What is happening everyone, welcome back and welcome to all the new viewers. This is another little Saturday night here out down at Port Adelaide, heading to the Hearts Mill for another fork in the road for some more food trucks goodness. Anyway, as always, I'm getting hungry so let's go eat. <laughs> Back to my old favourite of the old school bus here at the Falcon Road. New item on the menu too, so we're pretty excited to try this. This is the carbonara jack. It's pretty much a carbonara pasta inside a sandwich. I reckon Joe's getting that one here. Wow. I am having another second bite, hi. Oh, it's really saucy. It's really on like pasta sauce taste to it. It's like so much flavour as you bite down. You get a bit past the crispy exterior of the uh, the jack, but then once you bite down into the pasta, you get a nice explosion of, of pasta in your mouth. It's saucy, it's beautiful. Right? Mm. Uh, Rachel, I might just have both of these if you don't mind. Right. No, I'm sharing. No. Huh? This bit's mine. This is too good. <laughs> it smells great. It's like someone's made a really hearty bowl of pasta and put it with some in between bread. It's like a pasta sandwich. Pasta sandwich. <laughs> Blue to know. So I was still eating as she was recording. Good meal from thanks again from the people from the old school bus. That was like you know you, you know how you eat pasta and you had like the bread left over and you just dipped your bread into the pasta? Yeah. That's what it was like in the end. Yeah, it's like dipping your bread in the pasta bowl after. But, yes. Thanks again old school bus. Second dish of the day is from uh, the AB from the, I think how do you pronounce it, Stasi and Co? Like, Stasi. Stasi, so it's a Greek vegan food. I haven't vlogged about these guys in a good year or so now. I've got their vegan AB, lamb, quote unquote lamb. Look at that, it's nice. When biting down onto it, it's like, you get the same taste and flavour as lamb. The texture's maybe slightly different. It feels like it's lamb flavoured tofu in a way, but, but it's still good though, like it's, Actually, I would recommend this. Like, it's a lot of flavour too as well. The chips are good too. Beautiful. Got a vegetarian pizza from the Rolling Pizza Oven. Spinach, pumpkin, caramelised onion and feta. And what I like about it is they've actually roasted the pumpkin before they've put it on the pizza to cook. Oh yes. That caramelised onion is so good. And the feta is nice and salty. So, oh, it's a nice vegetarian pizza. And the dough's nice and soft, nice and chewy. Yeah. Good, good pizza. I'll try a slice. Too fresh, like really, okay, the vegetables are really fresh on the cheese. Not too much, much cheese on it, but like it's, there's a good ratio of cheese and vegetables too. Is that pumpkin or sweet potato? Pumpkin. Pumpkin. Oh, that's nice. Pumpkin roasted and pumpkin. Roasted pumpkin. Mm. Never thought I had roasted pumpkin on a pizza before. That's uh, pretty beautiful there. Look at it. Taco Cat is Taco Cat spelled backwards. Okay, this one's the Speedy Gonzalez. Chicken guacamole, the uh, Gary, with um, black beans and potato. You can smell the spices coming off it and it just. It's tasty. I'm lost for words. Oh, I'm gonna try it. Potato one? Yeah. That's fresh, it's like a very light taco, not too already too greasy. But that spice though. There it is. Yeah. There's the spice. It didn't hit me at first though. I can feel it now. That little aftertaste spice. I'll try the chicken. Chicken's nice to cook too. A little bit crispy that's talk. Not too spicy either. So I would rather the potato one. Yeah, believe it or not, I would eat the potato one instead. Okay now we're gonna get some I'm gonna try two waffles, street waffles and one Belgian waffle here. It's got such a good crispy exterior and the little caramel just sitting there in the middle. How is it? Oh, that crunch. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Now try for the, now for the Belgian waffle here. It's all the place gooey. Oh, wow. That sauce just really makes it matter. It's nice and sweet. And just like every other food video we do, we've always got to finish up one item. Bubble bus bubble tea. I got the mango with uh, coconut jelly and Rachel's got the... Light sheet oolong. Mm, beautiful. That now finishes off today at Fork in the Road, man. Thanks again to all the food vendors out today. Anyway, I'm full. Gotta take a nap. 
get again thanks guys happy eating and i'll see you all in the next one